Shortcrest High alum Katrina Young is currently one of the best divers in the country. In 2022, she won a silver at the World Championships, and she's already competed in the Rio and Tokyo Olympics. But right now, she's setting her sights on Paris. What are you saying to me? This is not for you, though. It's not for me? No, just oh, okay, so good, don't be good. offended. Okay. You don't love me the way that I love you. I knew from a young age or that I wanted to be a musician. Shoreline's Katrina Young has the voice of an angel. Try to fix it and now you say we're through. And while she dreams of someday taking her music to the top of the charts, right now she's focused on standing on the top of the podium. Broke my heart. If you do the dive right, it it feels magical. You, you kind of feel like supernatural in the moment. More like superwoman. Say go. The three-time national champ is training to make her third Olympics team. I think I have unfinished business, really. I believe that I can be on the podium at the Olympics. And that's something I've struggled with in the past when I get to the Olympic stage is dealing with the pressure. I want to prove to myself that I can nail that dive. I can be on the Olympic podium. Super talented. I mean, Thanks, you're absolutely amazing. You know that. Thank you, baby. <laughs> Since the Tokyo Games, Katrina married her soulmate, Mike. She moved to Southern California to train at USC. A little bit more on behind here. With former Olympian and coach, Hung Ping Lee. And that's a beautiful dive, seven and a half. From our promises and weakness. She's always had rhythm. A lonesome far off gaze. Now she's found the harmony. The biggest thing that I take out of sport is believing in yourself and living from your heart. It's about becoming the person I want to be and pushing myself to be the best person in and out of the pool. Katrina, that looked good. In Rio and Tokyo, Katrina competed in the individual 10 meter. Five meter, please. One. Now she's also trying to qualify in synchronized diving. A challenge that has double the difficulty of perfecting. This is hard. And somehow you are behind her though. So you need to figure it out. Synchro or solo, Katrina knows the journey to Paris won't be easy. Every time is a huge challenge, a huge hurdle to get over. So it never gets easier. And I think that I've kind of found myself a little bit more and I would love to go out there and really put my heart on my sleeve more than I've ever done before at the Paris Games. I can feel your hand. She dives to her own beat. The now, and while music brings her joy, representing the U.S. gives Katrina pride. Yeah, I feel like it's an honor every time I'm on the stage for diving for the U.S. Katrina is very proud of her grandpa, a U.S. veteran, and her grandmother. Her grandma, Elaine, competed in the 1948 Olympics in track and field. And Chris is going to be reporting from Paris throughout the Olympic Games, opening ceremony set for July 26th.